Connor, uh, you were one of the first people I ever talked to about social media. In fact, I think you were telling me all about it when I, about six or seven years ago, and I was going, what? What are you talking about? So tell me about what Boss Metrics is and how does it differ from some of your previous escapades? Yeah, I think uh, I do remember those times um, at some award ceremonies. I was at Rabo Direct, and I was hearing about Web 2.0 across Europe and across the world, and oh, that's amazing. It became social media, and uh, so since then I've worked in social media services and run socialmedia.ie. So at the end of last year, I just thought there must be an easier way to get um, my ideas and educate people about social media rather than doing it one to one. So how do we do it to Manny? Uh, it's through a product, through software. So we uh, pitched to get into the NDRC Launchpad program, which we succeeded in doing, and we launched bossmetrics.com just a few months ago. And, and tell me, how does Boss Metrics work? If I'm, a, if I'm a manager of a company or an owner of a company or an individual who, who sees this stuff happening and I'm going, oh my God, what is this? Uh, or how do I get my head around it? How do I actually make it work for me or my company? How does it work? Yeah, well, the way it typically works is that they might think, oh, I must go on a training course. So they go on a training course and maybe I'm there or one of our team is there. Um, but then when they go back to the office, what to do next? Well, what they do next is they go to bossmetrics.com. They set up uh, an account in a matter of seconds. And using um, their face, they can, using uh, the OWASP code, so we use, that's a technical term, but they bring in their Facebook, their Facebook data, their Twitter data, their Google Analytics data into one dashboard, gives them a simple report, which is color coded, and it, it gives them an indication of how they're performing. And we also then give them advice on where they're going right, where they're going wrong, and what they need to do to improve their scores and compare them against their competitors. It's kind of like clout with a bit more personal attention. It's like clout for your business, yeah. Of course, clout is very much a personal score of how you're ranking. This is clout for your business, clout for your marketing of your business. How do you compare with other businesses of a similar nature? And if you're not doing so good, what do you do about it? How do you fix it? We give, we give advice and tips on how you improve your scores, which is quite unique. How have you been funded so far? How have you, uh, what kind of uh, steps have you taken? I know uh, there's a lot of this would be self-funding through providing courses and stuff like that, but uh, you've, you've, you've worked with the NDRC, for example. Can you tell me a bit about that? Yeah, we got uh, uh, accepted on the NDRC Launchpad program, so we did the accelerator there, and they, they uh, gave us 20,000 and um, brought us through a lot of um, mentoring programs, etc. Uh, after that, during the summer, we applied for the Enterprise Ireland CSF fund, which is 50,000, and we got accepted uh, onto that. So we're now working with them and some of their mentors to try and uh, get us investor ready for further investment for our expansion into other countries. So what we're working with now is we're working with a number of universities who are using our product, a number of training companies, and these are companies we worked with before. So we're actually kind of bringing our product back to the people that we used to train and they love it because it's filling a gap that was that was there. And it's very affordable, it's starting at 15 euros per month. So it's very affordable for a small business who's who just wants to get better, get faster, know what's going on and not have to spend a fortune. And uh, I suppose the future is looking good in the sense of like, what trends are you seeing in Irish business in terms of how they're taking up uh, social media? Like, are, are, they, are, they, are, are there many businesses taking it up or is it a case that Ireland may be behind international trends? What are you seeing from how, how they're approaching it? Yeah, I think uh, still we're, we're behind um, our, you know, international companies, but the people still, they're looking at international examples, they want to get better, they, they, they're, they're doing more training, the training is kind of, um, needs to be supported with software, so what's happening now is the big, the big data, the big explosion in data analytics, that's coming now, and we're here to, to help the smaller business with an affordable entry-level product into that space. And then when they master that, I'm sure we'll have another product for them.